Okay, y'all. So let me see if I can set this up. It says that I am on. Hmm, let me see. Oh, I think I know what I gotta do. Wait, can y'all hear me? Hold on. Let's see. I really should have went live on my. I really should have went live on my laptop, y'all. Let me see if I can get on my laptop. I am trying. Once I get this on my laptop, then we'll be good. But right now, I am not on my laptop. I'm trying to see. Let's see. Wait. Hold on, y'all. I need to remove, remove this one. Okay. Okay. Let's do that like that. Why is it echoing? Wait, hold on a second, y'all. Wait, hold on a second, y'all. Oh, okay, let me see. Okay, do that like that. Okay, period. All right, so that's removed. Okay, so my question is, if I if I take myself off my phone, will that end the live? Because I don't want to end it. Hold on, let me see. Man. No, it ain't going to take you off there. It ain't going to take you off there. If you, if you switch, it's not so gonna it's take going to take you off. So if I press in live on my phone, it's still gonna be on my last time. No, you can't press in live. Just get out of the tab. Like just in the tab. Close the tab. Like close the tab. Like press the X. Like press the X. No, not in live. Just close the tab up. It's still playing on my phone though. No, you gotta exit out there, motherfucker. Like exit. Close the tab. Like. Wait. Make it go away. All right. Can you hear me? Hold on, y'all. Yeah. Yeah, I hear you. I can't tell you. I'm fine a little bit. I love this one. This one. Okay. You got to close the tab on the computer, like whatever you want and shit. All right, y'all. 
right, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. that was like a lot of work. Like, <laughs> yo, I see why people be needing help with these freaking this little stupid app. Cause come on now, stream your right. It's a whole a lot, a whole lot of. So I'm about to cut my camera on, and you tell me, you tell me if I need to go back to my phone or not because I I see. my camera <laughs> looks trash on this. Hold on, I want to just make it me. Not again, babe. But how do I just put me in here? Okay, yeah, you can be in my That's bathroom. It. That's it right there. What's that? Wait, hold on. My camera is flipped. Do my camera look flipped to y'all? Yeah, it's good. It's good. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> What's funny? Yeah. Because <laughs> if you got something to say, you can say it. Oh, okay. <sighs> okay, y'all. So we finna do this Olipop review. I bought hella drinks. Let me see if I can back this up a little bit. You can't even ah, you can't even see the drinks. Does the camera look like dark to you? Mm-mm. It looks clear. Yeah, like you know, when you edit it, you can lighten it up and shit too. You know how? Right now? No, when you edit it. Okay, y'all. So I have all these Olipop drinks. Hold on. So let's see the flavors. So I have so many flavors. Hold on. I'm about to organize them, then I'm going to put them back in the screen, y'all, because I heard a lot about these drinks and I'm about to review them. So we have, hmm? I said that's fire. Two, four, six different flavors okay see like it looked a little the screen not looking how i want it to look but you said it's fine so i'm gonna believe you but if it look how i think it looks then i'm gonna be mad later but that's fine so anyways y'all so first we have (laughs) wait hold on okay so first we have this orange squeeze First of all, let's. What is Olipop? That's the question. What is Olipop? Okay, so it says prebiotic, botanicals, and plant fibers. <laughs> Ooh. If you're gonna be talking, you are gonna get the X button. And then press me real quick. Yeah, me too. So please, <laughs> it's not time for you to talk. It's not time for you to talk. Anyways. <laughs> So yeah, prebiotics, botanicals, plant fiber, and it's non-GMO. This is some shit that need to be in. This is some stuff that need to be in California. I'm not gonna try to cuss y'all. So, anyways, it says a new kind of soda, but I thought it wasn't soda. Hmm. Okay, I think this is the only soda one then, because this one says a new kind of soda, and this one says sparkling tonic. Y'all see that? And this is grape. So I already know this flavor is going to be disgusting because grape is nasty as hell. And it says supports digestive health. So, you know. And then it says a whole bunch of stuff on the back. Hold on. This camera being like flipped backwards is like making me not turn the stuff the right way. Like, my camera's, like, flipped. I don't know if that makes sense. Why is that your picture? Why is that your profile picture? Anyways, it says, Olipop combines the classic soda you know and love with prebiotics, plant fiber, and botanicals to support your microbiome and digestive health. Finally, a refreshing soda that's actually good for you. It's good for you, y'all. So I got six of them. I'm not going to drink all six, but I'm going to take a sip out of all six. So I don't want to hear nothing. Our old-fashioned root beer melts just the right amount of classic bite and creamy sweetness with extracts of sweet birch, smooth vanilla bean, and real burdock root. So do they all say a whole bunch of other stuff? Okay, so on every flavor, it gives like a little description of how the flavor is just the best flavor of what it's supposed to be so the question is which one should i try first so i have cola vintage cola so basically 
I guess like the original Coca-Cola flavor is what it's supposed to taste like. And then I have classic root beer. Now, back in the day, I used to love root beer. I don't like root beer now, but I used to love root beer. And I have orange squeeze. I know that's going to be disgusting because I don't like orange. I don't like grape either, but I got it. Classic grape. Tropical punch. See, these all say sparkling tonic, so I don't know why they're saying soda because it isn't tonic water like water. Anyways, and strawberry vanilla. So, <sighs> which one do y'all think is going to be the nastiest flavor? Cap, you can cut your uh, mic on now. I personally think... <laughs> I, I personally think the tropical punch is gonna be the most nasty one because I don't like trop I don't like punch. Like it's nasty. Fruit punch is always nasty. I think the grape one is gonna taste like grape, which is nasty. And I think the orange one is gonna taste like orange, which is nasty. But I think the strawberry vanilla is gonna be good. I hope that the root beer is gonna be good, huh? That's the one that's gonna be nasty, strawberry vanilla. No. Nah. I hope the root beer is good because yeah. And vintage cola, I hope this one is good. So I like, I hope three of them is good, and I know three of them is gonna be nasty. So should I start with the orange? Yeah. Okay, y'all. I'm gonna try the orange squeeze first because I know it's nasty. All right. Okay, it cracked open like a regular Coke. It don't smell like orange. It looks clear. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is nasty. First of all, <laughs> First of all it tastes like orange water. I don't know what I was expecting, but it tastes like orange water. Like, if you ask me, do I want one of these or do I want an orange soda? I'm going to say neither, but if I had to choose, I'm going to say orange soda. And it's kind of clear, y'all. I don't know if I can show y'all what I was doing. It's kind of clear. I might pour it in a clear glass later on. Yeah, that's nasty. So that was that. On to the one that I think is also going to be nasty. I'm going to try the grape one next. Okay. Okay, the grape one has more color. Oh, I so see it. The grape one has more color. Anyways, the orange one didn't really have any more color. It was like watered down, but whatever. So let's try this one. Ooh, that was nasty as hell. That tastes like great. And it don't mm -hmm. taste good. It's nasty. That's nasty. Okay, y'all. So, so far, they nasty. So, I'm going to say, so far, the orange one is the nastiest. And then the... The orange one is the nastiest. No, the grape one is the nastiest. And then the orange one. I'm going to put it in order from like best to least, right? So I'm going to try the tropical punch now. Okay. Let's see the color. See the color is what's killing me because the color is like clear, and I don't kind of I don't I kind of don't like that. But you know what? With sparkling waters, when this flavor is always like clear, so I guess that's like from not having artificial artificial flavoring or something. I don't know, but let's try it. Hold on, this one is better than them two. Would it taste sweet? Ugh, it's not good. Um, 
honestly, this one is going behind orange. So, so far, it goes grape is the nastiest, then the tropical punch, and then the orange. So, I'm surprised because I honestly thought, so this one's the nastiest, then this one, then this one. So, on to the fourth one. We're halfway done. So, which one should I try next? Should I try the strawberry vanilla, the classic root beer, or the vintage cola? Not your house clean. Try the vintage cola. Vintage cola next? Okay, y'all. So, I really hope this one is good because, like, what the hell? Why would y'all make a Coca-Cola drink and then have the drink be nasty? <laughs> so, we're going to see. When I open it, it has like smoke coming up. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but like, yeah. All right. This one looks dark, like a Coca-Cola. So we finna see if it's any good. And you wanna and you wanna know what else though? When I held it up like this, you could already feel like the Coca Cola vibes. Like, have you ever inhaled Coca Cola before? Mm -hmm. Like the the smell. Yeah. This smells like Coca Cola. Hold on. Ooh, it's kind of nasty. One thing about these drinks, they got a nasty after aftertaste. Ooh. I'm gonna put that in front of the orange soda though, because that was still kind of nasty. Kind of want to do it like this. Is this view better? Kind of. Yeah. It's yeah. A bit, it's a little better. Hold on. Let me see something. Tell me something good. Is the light like too dark? Like, do I look in dim lighting? Uh, a little bit. Y'all, if I look in dim lighting, it's not my fault. It's not my fault. So, okay. yeah. It's better like that, yeah. It's better? Mm-hmm. So, so far, you like the coat? So far, Grape is losing. Tropical Punch is next, orange, and then Coca-Cola can go in front of orange. Wait, let me try orange again. I'm scared. Honestly, it's kind of like a tie between these two. So I'm going to put it like that. But hold on one second. Before I try these two drinks, I need to check on my child because I hear him up there messing stuff up so i'll be great huh i said now he woke up on me yeah i hear him so i'll be right back let me go check on him. she already know them pops nasty yo that's the kind of pops that ain't really like it's, that's some type of pop, like when you like on a diet or some shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you trying to lose weight, you drink that type of shit. You know what I'm What's this? Shout out to y'all in the bushes and shit. What y'all little ass doing in the bushes, huh? That shit kind of hard, ain't it? Now she left me and I don't know what to say. I ain't got nothing to try. You know that I don't know nothing about none of that. Nothing about the Olipop and the 
<laughs> what you talking about? Shit. You trying to keep a mock up high? Try to. I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> okay, thing. y'all. Give me one more second. I'll be right back. I had to come check on y'all. <sighs> See, I told you I was doing a good job. It's real. I'm gonna have to grab some of them bitches to try. Like, I don't really be trying to hear that because sometimes, you know, stuff be overhyped, overrated, and then people claim it's good, and then it ain't no good, and then you be mad. Like, you know what I'm saying? Type shit. Because every time I get something that ain't good, I be triggered. I be, ooh, they lied to me? I drink regular sparkling water, peach. <laughs> hey, put my shit in the freezer right now. I don't drink none of that. Regular peach. Who child? The life of a mother. What what you talking about? No, I was saying I only drink uh peach sparkling water. You know what? And I got some of those, but that's besides the point. So, anyways. Should I try the classic root beer or should I try the strawberry vanilla? Try the root beer. Strawberry vanilla is going to be last. So try it last? Yeah. Okay. So we are about to try the classic root beer. Ooh, this thing. It smells like it smells like off brand. Like it smells like fake root beer. Damn. Like the way root beer smells. Yeah. It smells like they're trying to mimic that smell, but it's not root beer. If that makes sense. Mm-hmm. Smell like candy. Wait, hold on now. This might be the best one yet. It tastes like root beer. Hold on now. Let me get some. No. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but this is the best one yet. Okay, classic root beer for the win. Put it in the front. Last but not least. I know that's going to be last. Do you not? Do you have something against strawberry and vanilla? Nah, I just know it's going to be nasty. Like, who put strawberry and vanilla together? You know what I'm saying? A lot of people. Like, a, what do you think? What do you think a strawberry shortcake is? Nah, I'm saying strawberry cream. But that's like strawberry vanilla. Strawberry and cream is a thing. Like that's, that's a like, big thing. That sounds that's like regular. That's not like bath and body work. Strawberry and vanilla. Anyways, strawberry and vanilla, y'all. This is the last one. Honestly, it doesn't smell like anything. And this one is actually dark liquid too, which is kind of scary because I watched the strawberry and cream one dark, but which one didn't have a color? The fruit punch didn't have a color and the grape, did the grape have a color? The grape doesn't really have a color and the fruit punch didn't have a color, but the strawberry one gets a color. That's kind of weird. But this is a support digestive health. So let's see. <laughs> oh, this one stank. At first I said it didn't smell like nothing, but now when I had got that whiff, it stunk. fire no okay so this is kind of nasty well hold on let me try the root beer one more time no i 
I don't know. I'm gonna put the strawberry one in front. So is all of these how they're supposed to be? <laughs> so this is what it's looking like, guys. So the classic grape one was disgusting. Zero, I will give it, I should have rated these. Okay, so the classic grape, I'm gonna give zero out of 10, do not recommend. Tastes nasty, don't try it. Tropical, the fruit punch one. If you like regular fruit punch, I would not recommend getting this as a substitute because it's very disappointing and like, just don't do it. The vintage cola wasn't that bad. Maybe if these drinks were like really cold or something and you drink it fast, it can mimic Coca-Cola, but mm. matter of fact, should I switch these? What I said, I said these two were tied, didn't I? Mm -hmm. These two were kind of tied, like when it comes to tasting like how they're supposed to taste. But I'm gonna go ahead and put orange behind the Coca-Cola only because I don't like orange flavoring. So I don't mind putting it in the back. The orange one, I would give like a three out of 10. The Coca-Cola, I would give probably like a 4.5 out of 10. The root beer, I would give probably like a 4.5, 5 out of 10. The strawberry, I would probably give like a 6.5 out of 10. So all together, was it worth the hype? No, it was not worth the hype. I feel like a lot of people like have these up. I've seen these on TikTok everywhere. Everybody's talking about some, oh, I drink Olipop. I drink Olipop instead of soda it's so much better it tastes so good they're liars this is nasty they're liars they just drink it because they're nasty yuck mouths i guess i'm just kidding y'all but not for real overall i rate this brand like a five out of ten but you know what it's kind of hard to make drinks taste good when you put so much healthy stuff in there i think so i don't think it's really like the brand's fault maybe my taste fault. Hmm? Save me that root beer one. Now she wants the root beer one so bad. But yeah, maybe it's just, you know, my fault because I'm not used to like drinking. I wouldn't say off brand because this is a brand, but substituting my sodas for, you know, a healthier option of the same flavor, I guess. What you got to say about it? Oh, before you start. So let me also say this real quick. So this one was 35 calories, 35 calories, 35 calories. The orange was 45 calories. See, I know you lie. And then this one is 35 calories and then 45 calories for the grape. So why is the grape and the orange the most calories when that's supposed to be the healthiest ones? Because those are the fruit flavored ones. And these are the artificial flavored ones. <laughs> so how that work? You fine. So let me see what else it says. Let me see how many carbs. Sixteen grams of carbs. Hold oh, on. Oh. How much sugar? That's a in lot there? of garbage. Huh? How much sugar in there? How much sugar? Zero. Three grams of sugars. Olipop is a lie. How was you a healthier option? You got all that sugar, all these carbs. It's supposed to say Joe's zero sugars and one card, not 16 grams, and 25 milligrams of sodium. Three grams of added sugars. Okay, but it can okay, so this one contains so the strawberries and Vanilla one contains 7% of juice. The root beer one contains 3% of juice. The Coca-Cola is 3% of juice, which I don't know what juice Coca-Cola comes from, but whatever. It's 3% of juice. Orange is 13%. Excuse you, sir. I'm sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Punch is 8%, and the grape is 9% of juice. Mm. So yeah, what do you have to say about this? 
Oh, what I got to say about this right here? Mm-hmm. Oh, you look cute a little bit. This camera really makes, it looks so old-timey. <laughs> like, it's a bump in my hair. But anyways, y'all, this is the my review. This is just my opinion. This is not fact. Do not take anything I say as fact. You can find this brand at Walmart, because that's where I got it. I don't know about anywhere else. I can only tell you about Walmart. Yeah, no. Hmm? I'm going to have to try it out. Don't. I just said you're out of 10. Don't recommend. No, my overall view is 5 out of 10. Don't recommend. Damn. Yeah. That's, that's sad. Hmm? I'm going to just stick to my regular sparkling water then. Yeah. This was the best. So I'm pretty much done with this video. I will try to make... I'm trying to see how do you play your... How do I play my little outro I made? You got to go to videos. I see it, but I'm saying do I click on it and then end the live? Yeah, you click on it then end the live. <sighs> okay, y'all, I hate StreamYard. StreamYard is so hard. Like, I don't know how to work it at all. I'm trying my best. I'm moving all these drinks. What am I going to do with these drinks? I feel bad for throwing them away. Save me some. Man, okay. Mm -hmm. I'll save you the nasty ass, the nasty group. I'm trying not to curse on here, but it's just keep happening anyways. So let me see which video it is. <sighs> All right, y'all. Thank you for watching my Olipop review. It was nice. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share this video out with Everybody, is there anything else you want to say, Cap, before we go? Uh, nah. It was a nice review. Thank you for sharing with us. We appreciate it. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me see something. Okay, now cut your camera on. You said cut my camera on? I said cut your camera on. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Hey, Leo. <laughs> that is so funny. No, I'm smoking. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm smoking. I can't have my. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to like sense it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. I ain't monetized. No, nah, but they still a hit you, like. <laughs> now I just look. Now I just look stupid. You say you're looking stupid. Mine just look like a doofus. Hold on. Why you say that? <laughs> oh, no. Hold on. Hold on. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Now I just look like a doofus. Hold on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> you funny. No, I did it like a doofus though. One of the little clips. I was looking like a doofus. <laughs> Well, all right, y'all. I'm finna be gone. <laughs> if you, me and Cal finna do a late. We finna do a late night uh, live. But I need to end this live. What we finna do with that? We finna do it on my shit. All right here. But not on this video. I'm gonna make another video. All right. All right. You gonna be on camera? <laughs> you want me to be on camera? <laughs> You're funny. But shout out to y'all, man. <laughs> Peace out, man. Yeah, man. But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead, maybe you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head, under my bed, thinking something. Ma'am, you didn't press in line. <laughs> Jordan, you know.